I don't know what ask to you, <laughs> but you say you are a truck driver, yes? Yes, uh, and I, I own uh, eight trucks. Oh, okay, so you travel a lot. Yeah, I did, yes. Yes, all over the United States. Oh, okay. And Canada. I, I go up to Canada, too. Canada, too? Yeah. <laughs> That's it. I, I have friends in Canada. No, oh, very okay. nice. <laughs> so, um, a little bit shy, so I... <laughs> I understand. Because <laughs> I really don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just relax. That's it. Yep. It's all fun. All fun. That's it. Yes, yes. <laughs> today, today I'm here, but maybe uh, next time only you students and Bill in the class. <laughs> maybe, let's see. But uh, Ingrid, any other comment? Uh, introduce yourself. Please talk a little bit about yourself, where you are. <clears throat> okay. So, um, I'm living in Santa Catarina, in Brazil, uh, but I'm from Bragança, São Paulo, and I work as a secretary. <laughs> mm -hmm. What kind of businesses, what kind of business do you work for? Uh, it's a company of supplements. Oh, okay. Vitamins, supplements. Vitamins, vitamins and stuff like that? Yes, exactly. Okay, yeah. Very good. Thank you, Bill. Very good. Okay, Ingrid? Okay, thank you, Bill. <laughs> so far, very good. Excellent. That's it. Now let's go to a boy now. And let's go to this part here. Luciano, please. Say hello. Talk about you and please make the question. <clears throat> hello, Bill. How are you? I'm doing fine. I'm fine. My pleasure, my... The first day uh, and um, no first uh, one more time <laughs> is here. <laughs> yeah. Um I am uh, my name is Luciano. Uh, I am 14 years, 8 years old. I am my job is um my company is Max Gear and it's here. Mm -hmm. No ah. in the in, in the productions, the differential, differential oh. parts, no. In the oh, chrono, no. the pins, the cruise, uh, cruise, and the parts, the the, the different differential. Spy is here. Uh, differential, yeah. Yes. We, we call also call it a rear end here. Rear end gear, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, rear end gears. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. The like cases, it. cases, no. Differential gears, the planetaries, satellites. Good. No? Satellite. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Luciano, remember when I, I did a translation for Max Gear? Yes. Bill <laughs> helped me. Oh, yes. It's yes. very nice. It's very nice to <laughs> translate the, the yes. name, is yes. the, the, the parts, no? The, the piece. Yeah, yeah very, also, very... <laughs> owning trucks, you have to know it all. You know, you have to know all the parts, transmission, rear ends, uh, differentials, universal joints, and so on, you have to know all that. So I, I'm a mechanic too. So I worked on my own trucks. Same. Very, yeah. very nice. Yeah. <laughs> yes. That's it. Um, one question for Bill. Yes. Um, Bill, um, what is your favorite sports, your week and your job in your uh, free times? What, the gene? Oh, uh, my favorite sports when I watch it is football. American football, uh, not soccer, but oh, okay. like Seahawks are the, are the team here, you know, it's a, it's a uh -huh. football. And um, my, uh, I like to, I have an old car, an old truck. I have a 1949 Ford F1 pickup truck and it's got a race engine in it. And I, I like to work on that and do a little hot rodding around, you know, stuff. Um, I like building things. And I can do most just most anything electronic or uh, mechanical. Uh, that's how I do my time. And uh, friends, let me ask you: Is it uh, easy or hard to understand everything? Okay. It's okay. A little bit difficult. 
Uh, this depends the words. <laughs> depends on the words. Yeah? Depends the yeah. words. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. That's, so. that's it. But New that's words, it. for example. <laughs> depends Wait, on the. I, I not understand, Luciano. <laughs> <laughs> Ask me what word you need a, a translation on. I can I can help you. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> he said, "Okay, which word do you want to him to translate? He can translate for you if you need." But, uh, <laughs> I, I need to understand it first. <laughs> okay. But, you know, this is the opportunity, guys. I just want you to practice your listening. Yes. You know, that's it. Oh, it's a little bit hard, but that's the way uh, you have to get familiar with uh, American people speaking. It's different from when I speak because I cannot speak. My English is good. Yes, but not as good as Williams, <laughs> as Bills, because he's American and it's good for all of us here, right? Okay, Louis. Right. Thank, Thank you, Luciano. You. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you for the question. Now, another lady, I go to Raissa Elena. Let's go, Raissa. <clears throat> Introduce Hello, yourself. Baby. Talk a little bit about yourself and please make the question. Okay. okay. Hello, Bill. I hope you have good. I'm Raissa. I'm 23 years old. I'm a civil engineer. Mm. And how are you? I'm doing fine. Great. Fine. Thank you. It's the first time I speak in America. <laughs> nice. Very and, good. <clears throat> and I'd like to know, when you invited someone uh, to eat out, are you assuming you're, you are going to pay the safe, uh -huh. the safe bill? Is that true? I know. Ask me the question again. When when I'm going to ask somebody out to dinner or something, is that what you're saying? Mm -hmm. How would I ask them? Do you understand? Is that, how you is, that you, is that what you want? Is that what you're asking? <laughs> uh, no. that's, okay. that's okay just uh, i i my uh, the audio uh, between you and i are it's a little bit rough so uh, ask me the question again can you repeat the question Heisen? <clears throat> and when you invited someone to eat out mm -hmm. are you assuming you are going to pay the state bill oh oh okay yeah mm -hmm. usually you uh, are no? if, if I was to ask you out to dinner, mm -hmm. if I say, he said, I'd like to take you to dinner, I would pay. Okay. I'm inviting you. Okay? Okay. Okay. Yeah. So it's usually a gentleman, when he asks a lady out or some, invites somebody to dinner, he, 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 they're, they're paying. And let's say, say, uh, what we call going Dutch. Yes, guys. Going, going Dutch means each one pays their own bill. Like I say, hey, uh, hmm. Renato, I'm gonna, uh, let's go to lunch at uh, Dutch. That means Renato pays his meal and I pay my meal. Did you understand this, guy? This is very, very interesting. You can say here, we, we go... We go Dutch. Is that right, Bill? Yeah, D-O-T-C-H. Yeah, Dutch. Dutch. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Lo lowercase or capital letter for Dutch? Just Dutch. That, that's it. Oh, okay. Lowercase. Yeah. Uh, you know, there's an expression in Portuguese, friends, when you say, uh, we're going to go out for dinner, but don't worry, we're going to go Dutch. That means I pay 50% and then you pay 50%. Okay, okay, friends. Okay. Uh, it's okay. Uh, what do you say this in Portuguese? Hachar. Meia meia. Exactly. Meia meia. Hachar. Bill, in English we say uh, the expression is crack. <laughs> okay. Crack. We're going to go. Uh, if, if just for we're going to crack. Exactly. We're going to crack. Okay. Don't worry. Oh, I don't know. That's 50%. Yeah. Yeah. yeah 50 -50. We, 50 feet, we're gonna crack. That's it, that's what you say, that's it. <laughs> nice, very good. We go Dutch, right? That's it, yeah. okay. very good. But usually when, a, when a, a gentleman asks a lady or a friend to dinner or whatever, in, when they invite, uh, that means they're saying, I'm gonna pay for the meal or whatever. Mm -hmm. you know, like I say, uh, 
let's go to, uh, I invite you to go with me to a movie. Mm -hmm. Unless I say Dutch or you pay yours, I pay mine. I'm yours. I'm paying the bill. That's it. This is very much true because when you go, uh, Americans, even here in Brazil, but uh, they are incredible friends. If they invite you, they're going to pay you. you. You get a little embarrassed sometimes because they are so generous. I, you know, it's very true. American people are, I love my- They, they don't do that in Brazil? Well, I don't know <laughs> why. <laughs> you mean in, in Brazil, if I ask a, a young lady out to dinner, she has to assume that she's going to pay her, pay her bill and I pay mine? Or does a gentleman down in Brazil pay the bill? What do you what do you say, friends? Understand? Yes, usually I think. <laughs> but uh, here in Brazil, for example, when you go out with your boyfriend, he's gonna pay for that, right? Yeah. That, yeah. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. But that's it. Yeah. This is what happens here in, in Brazil too. Yes. Yeah, same. Same. Uh, Haisa, thank you. Very good question. Any other comment, Haisa? Thank you, no. Thank no? you. That's it. You're welcome. It was fun. <laughs> Very good. And congratulations on your first experience with American. I'm so proud of you. Thank you very much. Okay. Now let's go to a boy now. And what about you, Fabio? Let's go. Okay. Good evening, Bill. Yes. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure to talk to you uh, My pleasure. tonight. Yeah, uh, Bill, uh, you was a striker driver, and uh, I think you was very happy in your life about it. And I, I am operator machine. I am thirty one years old. I work in the same. I have been working in the same company around uh, eight years, and uh, now I, I change. Uh, I got a change uh, of the year, professional year, and uh, I I want to work uh, in the commercial year area and uh, area and uh, I I want to uh, I want to know uh, how you are advanced about it for me. Advice. Tonight. Advice. Advice. Yes. Thank teacher. No problem. Okay, uh, you're asking me about uh, advice about if you're changing your, your occupation. Is that what you're asking? Yeah. Um, yeah. I was in the trucking business uh, for 48 years. I, I'm happy because it's like a, um, I'm, you got to do what you're happy. What makes you happy and get out of bed in the morning, and go to work. Uh, if you don't like what the work you're doing, you're not going to be happy. Mm -hmm. So, my advice would be if this is what your heart says you want to do in life and it's going to make you happy and make you excited to get out of bed in the morning and get to work and do your job and do it well, that's, where, that's the way you need to go. But if you go to a job just for more money but you don't like it, you're going to be very unhappy. Sometimes you have to take a lesser paying job and be happy and then then take a, a higher paying job and not be happy. That's you know, amazing. happiness is, you have to have happiness in your life. That, that makes you live long. That's it. Okay. And uh, a lot. perhaps, Fabio, uh, I'm not saying that you don't understand, but in case you don't understand, because it's different. Don't worry, friends. I just want to give you this opportunity because that's not going to be the last opportunity. You're going to have more chances from now on. Bill and other American people will join your class because I want you to improve your English and have this wonderful opportunity to have American people hear something. It's my dream, to be honest. It's my dream to give you this opportunity. Did, did, did I answer his question right, correct? Did I understand what he was saying? Fabio? Sorry. Did I answer your Can you question? Repeat, please? Yeah, you are you are answering my question. Okay. And uh, yeah. I I understand. Yeah. Good. About the uh, the position, but I 
I need you want to my my occupation. How are you? I'm doing fine. How are you? I'm fine too. Uh, uh, what time is it? What time is it? Yeah. Oh, good uh, it's uh, 4.30. 4.30 oh, it's, more, it's more early. To yeah, hear. It's, it's about 70, 75 degrees out, which is here is nice. Oh, for you okay. it's cold, but for here it's nice and warm. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, I think I I don't have a, I have no question for you because my my question was uh, similar to Luciano's question. Okay. So um, could you uh, tell us about uh, how can I say uh, the typical activity Americans activity on Sunday, for example? One typical. America's activity. A zip code? Is that what you're saying? Yes, yes. On the weekend. On free time. Oh, um, I'm not understanding the question yeah. she's asking me. You, you, a, zip code, a zip code here is something to do with mailing. Uh, um, no. Diana, please. Okay. You know, by the way, Diana, I'm sorry. This is something very, very interesting. Because uh, when you say something... When we say something, he doesn't speak Portuguese. And then sometimes he, I am Brazilian. When you try to say one word, I can associate, ah, I know she's trying, he's trying to say this, but he's American. And then it's good for us to have this opportunity to improve our speaking. Right? Very good, Gianna. Can you repeat your question, Gianna? Okay, okay of course. Mm -hmm. uh, Bill, could you uh, tell us about a typical activity americans activity in your free time and on sundays for example oh you know you mean what i do on sunday and free time yes yes I, I oh, or, or your family or a friend yeah, okay yeah uh, sundays i go to church um and more that's more of a relaxing day but uh uh for me every day is sunday <laughs> <laughs> I'm, reti I'm, re I'm, re I'm retired. I'm uh, retired. I don't. Uh, I don't. Um, I've been retired for like. Uh, let's see, it's been uh, 11, 12 years now. Wow. And I, I sold all my trucks and stuff. But I just do what I want to do, and I. Mm -hmm. But on Sundays, I, uh, I. It's more of a relax. I don't do any work on Sunday. I go to church on Sunday, but uh, through the week, um, I just do whatever I feel like I want to do. <laughs> and I, I stay busy. You can ask Renato. I stay busy all the time. <laughs> uh, okay. That's a good example. That's the, the beauty of it all. Because I, whenever I ask Bill, Bill, can you participate today? Sure. Great. Okay. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> uh, we have to take advantage of his free time. He's totally free to help us learn English. Very good. Great. Great. That's amazing. It's a, a nice life. I want the, the life. The, like well, you, life. well, you're young. I, I'm 76. So <laughs> our nightlife is different. <laughs> so, so my, not, not so young. My, my, my nightlife is watching TV shows. <laughs> 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 I, I don't go out on the night on the town like you young people do. <laughs> but okay. He's a young boy. Bill is a very young and very extrovert, very energetic, yeah. energetic person. Oh, I had the chance to meet him. He's very strong. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Uh, okay, uh, you are a, a, a fun person, and, and thank you, thank you. You're, you're welcome. It's fun. <laughs> thank you, Jenna. Thank you very much. Great. Now another guy is Bruno. Now, please. Hello, Bruno. It's nice to meet you. My name is Bruno. Yes. Yes. Uh, my question for you. Uh, what's your opinion about uh, Joe Biden and uh, what your performance in, in front of this situation about a uh, pandemic? Well, I usually don't like talking about politics, but 
I, uh, this this last election was very bad for our country. It was it was I feel it was cheated on. Um, it was not a fair election. It was a, it was not right, and uh, we're having a battle in this country over that. And they're using the COVID uh, thing, uh, the mask wearing, and all that as a um, device to control people. And the, up here, I, I know it down there, it's a little bit different, but up here uh, we have 98% uh, uh, recovery rate. Wow. You know, I mean, so many people die from the flu every year anyway. I mean, that, that's just the fact of life. And, uh, and uh, uh, COVID-19 is a, a strain of flu. It's a little bit more... Um, a little bit stronger. It's more, a little bit worse than the flu, but mm -hmm. it, it, people recover from it. If you know, uh, it came to my house in January. We didn't even know what it was. And my wife was down for three weeks and I just got a cough. I've never been a sick a day in my life. Hardly. I, I think back in the 70s, I might have been sick for three days maybe. But wow. um, <clears throat> uh, that's just me. Mm -hmm. But it, it's a way of they want socialism here and we're, we're a free country and we don't want socialism or communism. And this is what's happening, uh, going on right now. And it's, that's why I don't like talking politics too much because I'm very adamant about it. And <laughs> Renato can tell you that I'm yeah. very, very hardcore conservative. So <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> I, okay. I hope I, I touched on you a little bit there. <laughs> That's it. It's a hard question uh, to yeah, answer. No, okay. Uh, thanks so much for the sharing this opinion about this situation. Because uh, I'm thinking too, is a pandemic is a situation for all around the world. And that's it. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Very good. Thank you, Bruno. Very nice. Now, Cristina, please. Hey. <laughs> Hi, Lou. How are you? I'm doing fine. I don't see you yet, but I guess. I'm fine. Too. There you go. Okay. Nice to meet you. Uh, I my question is about food. Food. Me. Mm, In the United good. States, the people like eat hot dog and hamburger because they like fast food. It's true. Do you like? It? Uh, there's a lot of people like fast foods, hot dogs, hamburgers and stuff, but I'm not too much in, I, I'm not too much on, uh, fast foods too, you know, cause they're the, 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 uh, it's, it's tasty food, but it's not good for you. Uh, I mean, it's full of uh, calories and fat and stuff, you know what I mean? Uh, if you notice, uh, we have, I don't know how it is in Brazil, uh, but up here we have a lot of overweight people. That's because the food is so full of calories and people, and it's addictive food. It's um, you can get addicted to hamburgers and hot dogs and uh, cheeseburgers and French fries and all those kind of things. I, I try to stay away from them. <laughs> I mean, they're good. I just don't partake of them that much. <laughs> okay, I, I don't like cheese. Okay, thank you about the, your answer. Thank you very much. Did, did I answer your question? That, is that what you wanted to know? No, only it. <laughs> Today, only it, because the <laughs> next. <laughs> I answer other questions, okay? Okay. Okay, Cristiano, thank you very much. Very nice. I think the boys, everybody asked it. Now it's missing. Lana and Giovanna. Lana, did you ask a question? Yes. Yes, and then Giovanna, please. <clears throat> okay. Hello, Bill. Yes, nice I to can. meet you. Uh, Lana, okay? Lana, let's go. Thank you, for, thank you for your participation in your class. You're welcome. But I'm a... Uh, I'm a... Uh, health manager in, in Brazil. I, I am 20 years, 30 years old. And 
My question is about the pandemic too. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, what's your opinion uh, about the pandemic in your city and in your country? And, well, my, and did yes. you get the vaccine? No, I didn't take, my wife is taking the vaccine. She's got to go get her uh, second shot um, on uh, uh, Saturday. Mm -hmm. uh, but I, okay. I, not, I don't take, I've never taken a flu shot. I have never, just, that's just for me. Um, I ne like I was telling the other, uh, they, I, I never get sick. So I don't need those things. There's people that are, are, are have problems and they take it, but, um, the pandemics is real, but it's not is what they put it up to be. It's. They make it more than what it is. I mean, it's bad, and uh, a certain amount of people are going to die from it as the flu every year. Every year, thousands of people in the United States die from the flu, and they're usually older people with um, upper respiratory problems and um, uh, not lived a healthy life, especially somebody that smokes a lot or... or uh, stuff like that uh, where their lungs are involved um, they the pandemic hits but it's uh it's subsiding here now it's starting to go away but it's more politics now than it is um, a uh, medical crisis I think okay okay it's not my opinion <laughs> because in Brazil the situation is very hard very yeah hard because that's the right here is I yeah, it's you, not you, go. It's yeah. not good governation. Yeah. yeah, you folks down down in Brazil, it's a, you have a different um, Very medical different. medical set uh, uh, a medical uh, uh, system than we have here. It's it's completely different, and um, you you have a lot of people that uh, smoke down there a lot, a lot of cigarette smoking and stuff, and that can, that that. Um, contributes to uh, to the flu and and, uh, and uh, COVID and all that stuff because you have upper respiratory problems. Uh, up here, we've been fighting against uh, that kind of thing for the last 20, 30 years, uh, uh, getting rid of the cigarette and smoking and stuff. But there's people that do it still. But I'm not saying that's totally all of it, but uh, the medical uh, um, hospitals and everything are different in Brazil than they are yes. here. Yes. And so we don't have as much, and we, you know, we had that herd immunity type thing going on, as, uh, as like the flu or anything else. This, this is just my opinion. Now, I'm not no doctor or nothing, but I'm just, you know, you know yes. what I'm saying? We're, we're talking back and forth here. That's and it. uh, it's, um, yeah, it, 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 Brazil is. I've been hearing they have like what um, I, I forget how fifty percent of the population or something like that has got COVID. Or is that correct? In Brazil, yeah, fifty oh, percent. No, I, I don't think so. Oh, I no. heard something. It was a it was a large amount. I, I, I don't large. Yeah, nowadays it's getting yes. worse and worse. But I don't know the the percentage of people who got COVID in Brazil. I don't yeah, know. but most people here, uh, they survive it. Uh, you know, uh, like I said, I, I it came to our house in January and we didn't even know what it was. It's before they called it a pandemic. And my wife was down for three weeks and uh, I just got a cough out of it. My dog just got a cough. But uh, <laughs> well, animals get it too, you know. It, um, but uh I, I, you know, I survived it. You know, I'm healthy. You know, I, Renato can tell you I'm pretty healthy. Yeah. Um, but I think it's all that depends. I see a lot of people that, that do a lot of smoking and stuff like that. And they're the ones that usually get stuff like that. It's, that's just my opinion. Okay. Okay. Thank nice. you for your opinion. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Lana. Very good. Now I think it's Giovanna, right? Or the in the mid again after okay. and Sergio, okay? That's it. Very good, Giovanna. Okay. Hi Bill, my name is Giovanna. I'm 18 years old. I live 
in Bragança Paulista, and I work with Instagram, social media, mm -hmm. on in an agency, agency. Agency? Yeah, called Glow Studios. Great. So, my question for you, for you is, would you like to visit Brazil? Would I like to visit Brazil? Yes. Uh, yeah, I would. I, but right now, I don't think we can go anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> right. I think I think we're stuck. <laughs> But I, I have, I've, I've been around, yeah, I have yeah. been around a lot of foreign countries. Mm -hmm. I, I've been uh, I've been around the world myself, and nice. uh, I've never been to Brazil. Yeah. If you come, what food do you like to eat? I would like to try Brazilian food. Yeah, all the foods are. One is specific. I I don't. Uh, you mean uh, Brazilian food? Yeah. Uh, I'm not familiar with Brazilian food yeah. except Juliana. She cooks me once uh, something I really like, and I can't remember what she said it was. But it was something yeah. her, her mama made. It was really good. Yeah. I think it's str a stroganoff. Yeah, something like that. I yeah. guess it was good. Yeah. <laughs> just, just once. Yeah. Just, this. just once. Oh my god. Yeah. That's oh the, my God! Really? Because, let me tell you something very nice, friends. When Juliana, Juliana, uh, if you don't know, it's my daughter. She's uh, uh, in the U.S. She's uh, married to Joshua, his uh, grandson. And when uh, Juliana got married, me and my wife went to the wedding, and my wife cooked it for the guests. Nice. Yes, she made it strong enough, and all the food was prepared by my wife. For all the Whoa. guests, yes. Okay. It's good. It's good. <laughs> that is just, okay. It's amazing. But you need to eat some food. Uh, I'm sorry, English? Stroganoff is a Russian food. <laughs> It's Russian. Yeah, I don't know, really. I don't know, too. <laughs> yes. <I> don't know. <laughs> good yeah. to know this. No new information. I had no idea. Ah, really? It's well, yeah, but she put a Brazilian flavor to it. Exactly, Brazilian pet. Yeah, Brazilian yeah. 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 It's the it. famous a brasileirada. That's it. Uh, you can make this as a verb. We Brazilian food. Yeah. <laughs> we can Americanize, so we Brazilian the food. That's it. And I see Christian. Very good. Great. Let's go for the last question. And after a, a message, and then we can uh, say goodbye. Not goodbye. Uh, wait, by the way, Bill, goodbye when you... Uh, can I say goodbye, even if I'm going to see you again next week? Can I yeah, say goodbye? Yeah, oh, right. see you, we say see you later, so long. Yeah, so long, see, that's yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. So long, see you later, adios. Adios, <laughs> hasta la vista. Great. Yeah. Sergio, please. Um, hello, hello, Bill. Uh, yeah. I'm I'm Sergio. I'm a mechanical engineer. I'm 31 years old. Yeah. Uh, I ask. I uh, firstly, I love the trucks because my father is truck driver too. Really? Yes. Yeah. Nice. My <laughs> first dream when I kid uh, is a truck driver, a but uh, my my father my my father told me. Uh, I asked my father, I asked my father, uh, when I, uh, who, who uh, projected the, the trucks? My, my father told me, and the mechanical engineers. Oh. And now, <laughs> because oh. I'm a mechanical engineer about, because this. That's it. Because the mechanical engineer design is the truck. Design, That's yes. It, yeah? You say okay. design, yes. That's design. it. Very good. Uh, okay. When you say the word uh, pro project, Sarah, just a question. When you say project, when you have image and then you project the image on the on the ah, screen, okay, right? understand. The word Sorry. is design. Yes, that's it. I that's know okay. because in Portuguese, that's it. Okay. I don't know if you and, know, guys, Sergio. Just is, do you see here, guys? Yeah. The, 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 yeah. This is little truck. <laughs> yes, this is the miniature. Miniature. Yeah. Me. As a present, yeah. when I was in the United States, it's a present from Bill. Very uh, good. Sergio. Uh, in the United States, is different trucks. Uh, uh, the Brazil, Brazil is is a 
the truck is small. The, no. the cab, cabins, cabins, I don't know. You say the, the cabin? The cabin is, is small, no? In Brazil. And in, in the United States, it's very bigger. Very big. Yeah, yeah I, I seen a, a picture. Uh, Renato, you sent me a picture mm -hmm. of one of your students that had mm -hmm. a, a, drove a semi truck. And I think I messaged you back. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, the, the trucks here are a little bit larger. Uh, larger but what yeah. I seen in, uh, in the photo he sent me, they were just as big. Um, I don't know where in Brazil he was traveling, but he had uh, what they call a B train. It was uh, mm -hmm. like yeah. a 40 foot uh, trailer uh, followed by another 40 foot trailer. But the, the trailer didn't have a dolly. It was part of the first trailer. And that's called a B train. Understand. And uh, um, up here we got what they call an A train, which is a tractor and two trailers, but a dolly in the middle. It, Do we, dolly, we, is dolly, dolly is the first. Uh, is the first. Uh, Let me show you. Ah. Yeah, <laughs> the dolly is um, connect connection connection. Yeah, connection. Yeah. Yeah. Here is a semi truck. Wow. Uh -huh. I don't know if you can see it or not. Let me let me get it up here. Yeah. That's a oops. That's a semi truck. Yeah. No, no, it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. okay. All right. Here's the rear trailer. I had to pick it up two pieces. Uh -huh. Oops. Can you see the wheel right here? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, the dolly. That's, that's the dolly. Ah, this is the dolly. dolly. Or or they call it or they call it a gear. Gear, okay. Uh, a, a gear but, or a dolly. dolly and it, a, that, now, in the United States, that's an A train. A, a train. A, a B train, train is when there's no dolly and the uh, the oh. rear trailer connects to the front trailer on a fifth wheel. You okay. you know what I'm saying there? Yeah, that's it. A fifth wheel is this part here. It's a little plate that the 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 trailer slides into and it clips the pin. Mm -hmm. That's called a fifth wheel. Fifth wheel. Okay. Fifth wheel. So wheel that's okay. Yeah, uh, five. Fifth, fifth wheel. Five. Fifth fifth wheel. Fifth wheel. Yes. Yeah, the same. The same in Brazil. In Brazil is the quinta roda too. Yes. Oh, yeah. yes. Okay. Um, yes. 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 Very nice. But, but uh, uh, mechanical engineer, they they produce everything, um, all the way down to a switch or a uh, transmission plane. gears, airplanes, you, anything you can see, a mechanical engineer has done it. He's designed it. Um, and even even something like a... That's it. Yeah, that's, uh, today, today I... Somebody I, had to draw that and somebody had to put it together and somebody had to draw all the parts yeah. to it, eh? Yeah. Yeah. And and then, and then now I, I work in the food in company. It's different for design <laughs> the trucks. <laughs> okay. yeah. and, and I have another question for you, Bill. Uh, you, uh, what the, the the trucks do you drive? The the Peter Built and the Volvo. What do you prefer? I own I own uh, Peter Built, Volvo, and Freightliner. The Peterbilt is very good because it have uh, a, a lot of uh, the, the uh, well gears. Built. <laughs> yeah, all I had, to, well, they all had my all my trucks had gear. Uh, I am known Kenworth. I had a Kenworth that had a Kenworth, five, yes, yeah, five good. speed main box with a three speed auxiliary. <laughs> yeah, it was like 20, twenty one gears all together back in the day. Sergio, and, uh, Sergio, my, you are speaking a different language now, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> and then the, most of my trucks had like a, what we call a road ranger, which is a 10 to 13 speeds. Yes. Yeah, a very and road ranger is a 10 speed and, 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 and some had a, the 13 speed had the yeah. shifter knob where you just flipped it to high, low range in each yeah. gear. Uh, the, the, the truck driver needs the uh, needs the the three ma the three hands for the to change the, the yeah the see they are, they are, we we I used to I used to have a Kenworth truck that did that but nowadays the engines are so powerful and so much horsepower you can't take your hands off the wheel anymore so they don't produce the double stick transmissions anymore yeah 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 the main transmission the auxiliary transmission they they don't have those anymore they're all into they got eighteen and twenty one speed transmissions. 
and they're all done with one stick. And uh, ah. you just twist the knob on the top of the shifter, and it shifts the electronically. Electronically, yeah, it's automatic. Yeah, yeah. It, it does all the other stuff that two stick uh, two sticks did. Yeah, and, yeah. and then uh, we also had uh, back in the day a two speed rear ends. Yeah, but yeah, I prefer high, high and low rear end. Yeah, but I, uh, I prefer the, the manually the, the change manual. The, the, the manual. The, yeah, yeah and very, a, lot of, a lot of them in the United States now are uh, they're, they're getting away from all the stick transmissions and going to automatic transmission. Yes. Yeah, that's very awesome. Good. Thank you, Will. Awesome. Yeah. Very nice. Serge, is that yeah. your question? Yeah, that, 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 that's it. Okay. That's, that's okay. Very Thank nice. you. My, mm. Sergio, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Yeah. Okay. Now, uh, everybody had the question. Now it's time to go back and start giving the message uh, before we say uh, goodbye or see you soon. Or what do you say? I forgot. See you later. See you later. Adios. See you later. Adios. Okay. <laughs> so let's start. And then I'm going to start here. Now I start with the man. Okay, Fabio, please, once again, thank you for your, we are not over, okay, the class is not over, just this part here with uh, Bill, but with this conversation, Fabio, tell us, tell Bill, please, a message uh, for Bill about this moment, anything else you'd like to say, please, Fabio, feel free. Okay, uh, Bill, uh, again, it was a pleasure uh, talking with you, learning with you about English and Hey, I I am thankful for your helping me, your help us uh, learn, learn English tonight. God bless you. Uh, again, it was a pleasure talking with you. Great. Very good. I, I enjoyed talking to you. It's nice to meet people from all over. <laughs> Thank you yeah. very much. It's all good. Yes. Now, lady, I go here. Lana, please. Your message. Thank to you, Bill. Bill. <laughs> Thank you, Bill, for your participation. You are very funny. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hey, you're welcome. You're welcome. That's it. And uh, Bruno, please. Any message or any other comment? If you have any other question, feel free. Oh, okay. Uh, the first of all, thank you so much for this new for participation, this special moment with the Earth. I'm thankful for all to improve your English and uh, to dedicate the, your improve your English. And Bill, thank you so much for sharing this moment. Okay, and for all, uh, thank you so much to participate in the English class. To uh, how to say interagir? I forgot this word. How can I say, friends? Interact. 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 For all and uh, for Bill, the uh, good questions and. That's it. It's my, my message. Thank you, Bruno. Thank you very well, much. Great. And Cristina, please, your message to be all. At this moment, it's more important to, for the class. Thank you. And take care about the COVID. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the next moment, I hope it again. Great. Thank you, Cristina. Very good. And uh, uh, Lou, please, Luciano. <clears throat> Hello. Thank you, Bill. Thank you for the, the participation tonight in the crest. It's very, very special. The moments and then new words, the, the peoples. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. It's been a pleasure. Great. Haisa, please. Oh, microphone. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Thank you, Bill. It's a pleasure to meet you. It was very important to me and very fun. Thank you. You're very welcome. Nice. Thank you very much. And uh, Sergio, please. Oh, thank you, Bill, for the, the turkey dialogue. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Anytime yes. you want to talk trucks, just call me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's very the first time I I talk with a uh, truck driver, the American truck driver. Yeah, it's very very it's very fun. It's very interesting for me. And thank you so much. See you next uh, 
guys uh, next moment. Thank you. Yeah. Very good. Great. And now is uh, Diana, please. Thank you, Bill, for your time. Uh, was a pleasure uh, to hear you, to talk uh, with you. Uh, know about uh, your family, your your country, your free time, and I I hope uh, to visit your country soon. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Hope we so. go. We go together, <laughs> family as yeah. I do. Okay, we're gonna go yes. together. Maybe one day. Thank you, Gianna. And uh, let's go to the truck. Yeah, let's go by truck. Yes, I take the truck. You go to the United States. <laughs> come on, come on, let's go. Uh, Giovanna, did you give your message? No, not okay. yet. Please. Thank you, Bill. Thank you for this moment, and thank you too, because you share your time with us and your knowledge. Knowledge. So thank you. It's nice to meet you. Very good. Nice to meet you too. And uh, Ingrid, did you give your message? Not yet, teacher. Please, yes. <laughs> so, thank you, Bill. I love the time. And I want to teach you a word in Portuguese. It's ah. obrigado. <laughs> ah, nice. Please, Ingrid, can you uh, make him speak the word? What is the word? Obrigado. It means thank you <laughs> in Portuguese. Obrigado. That's yes. it. <laughs> yeah. 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 Very good. Say that again, Bill, please. Bill? Yeah. Bill, say that again. What is the word? Let's see if you remember. Obrigado. Yeah. That's <laughs> it. Very good. I, I, got it written, I got it written down here somewhere. Yeah, I know, I know. that's it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you uh, the, the point is Juliana is there all the time they live close kind of close but Juliana yeah. doesn't teach them Portuguese because she loves English very very much <laughs> and let me Bill let me tell you something Bill I, I don't you know guys this is true my daughter is Brazilian I can show you here my conversation we don't speak uh, Portuguese anymore because she's pretty much into English all the time. And then, Dad, I'm sorry, I'm doing this, this. We are talking about serious pro uh, situations, always in English, Bill. <laughs> 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 always in English. This morning, I tried to call Joshua. Uh, he didn't uh, didn't get a hold of him. And then, Aju, hey, I'm trying to get a hold of Joshua, but I don't get the answer. Oh, Dad, I'm sorry, he's driving. Some Always in English. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah I, every now and then I surprise her. I uh, I say something in Portuguese. Portuguese. And she goes, what? <laughs> I I I can I can speak a little bit, but I can I when you say it back to me, uh, and I I don't understand it. That's you know, it. I, I'm not used to hearing it. I'm used to saying it. That's it. It's the same that uh, to us here. Yes, uh, this is the the struggle we have when you when you learn English. You know, it's it's normal, but. Uh, before, uh, so Bill, not everybody else gave the, the message, I think so, right? Yeah, that's it. If you guys yeah. have any other uh, uh, message, please just let me know. But Bill, what about you now, Bill? What is your message about this moment? What do you can say to the students in terms of you know learning process, please? Well, I I enjoy this. Um... Believe it or not, <laughs> I, it, uh, I enjoy these times because I need, I love seeing young people that have an initiative in life to get out and be something and do something and make, make a difference in the world. And mm -hmm. to do that, nowadays, you have to learn English. It's a universal language throughout the world. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, this is bettering yourself, bettering your fellow man and, and, uh, makes you uh yeah you can go anywhere and do anything you know you, your sky is the limit you know you just mm -hmm. it, it, it does me good to see young folks do this uh, i i enjoy it great and uh bill in terms of uh, uh sometimes a little bit uh, difficult of course because of the connection here but do you understand everybody's english here 
Yeah, I, I do for the most part, but sometimes the audio is not mm -hmm. very good. And I have to ask, you know, um, to repeat because the audio might be breaking up or distorted a little bit. So, but other than that, I understand everything. Great. Yes. That's it. And a lot of times, if I see them talking, uh, I can read their lips a little bit and I can understand yeah. what they're saying. Yeah. Great. That's it, friends. Uh, Bill, we have to uh, let you go right now. Thank you so much. Before that, guys, let's take a picture with Bill. Yes. Everybody, just a second. Yeah. <laughs> Moment to fix the hair. And... Uh, I, I, the hair? Yeah, that's it. Oh, hey, Adriana, <laughs> please, let me think I have hair, okay? It makes, makes, me, feel, <laughs> makes me feel good about it, yeah. <laughs> it's all in the mind. That in my mind, okay? In my mind, I wake up in the morning and I shave. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. I feel good about it. I'm just kidding. So let's take a picture. One, two, go. Perfect, guys. Bill, thank you so much. All I can say again, thank you very much. And friends, let's clap. Yeah, let's give it up to Bill, please. That's <laughs> it. Thank you. Great, Bill. Thank you also. Great. Very Bill. good. Thank you. You can click there if you want, Bill. And uh, adios, amigos. Adios. I'll tell you. <laughs> See you later. Adios. Adios. So long. So long. Goodbye. So long. So long. Yeah, so long. Yeah. See you later. So long. That's it.